Their eye-hand skills are off the charts. One-handed, two-handed, so many shapes and sizes. I don't even know what that is, but these kids sure do. But bragging rights are at stake here. That's Adam Chen, a junior at the Seven Hills School and the brainchild behind Cubing for Kyle 2019, benefiting the Kyle Plush Answer the Call Foundation. Kyle and I had a strong bond over Cubing, so, what, so I think it's a great way to honor our friendship through a Cubing uh, competition. Chen says he's blown away by all the support. It's honestly way more than I expected. A full house here at the Lakeside Presbyterian Church and sponsored by the World Cubing Association. I use the beginner's method. I'm around a minute, so I'm good for a beginner, I guess. Gwen Kinman is just getting started, Ryan. but happy to help out. I'm taking the scramble cubes down to the tables so and calling people's names so they can solve. So when I went to Seven Hills, I was the new kid. I had to transfer from out of state. He was in math class with Kyle. That's how they met. And he was one of the first people who welcomed me, who introduced me to all my friends that I know today. They had some friendly math competitions who could do better on tests and things. It's an amazing feat for, a, for anyone, but let alone a 16-year-old. While the kids cubed, Jill and Ron Plush told people about their foundation's mission. Which is uplifting families and communities to live their best lives. I've always enjoyed spending time with friends and enjoyed friendly competition. I'm seeing people walk away um, that they're going to take actions that are ultimately going to help in the safety of their families. So it's very rewarding. I hope he's very proud of what I did. Um, I'm very proud to be his friend and I hope that I can make him proud as well.